am Lord Shane von Shane, and this is my family estate, built on the sweat, tears, and blood of generations. My authority has been usurped by your nemesis, Malister the Undying. However, he will reward me greatly for destroying you. By crossing this threshold into Castle Darkmoor, you have put yourself at my mercy. I would be kind. But this is Howling Janey, a poor, savage beast whose life is limited to small joys. Howling Janey? Crypty wizard's lungs out. Remember this very child. We learn from failure, not from success. Even a wizard who is pure in heart both day and night may become a wolf when the wolfbane blooms and Darkmoor's moon is bright. Dead men have all eternity to pine after their lost loves. I salute you, Seeker. I am Sir Blackwater, once a paladin of the forces of light. It was my duty to rid this land of the vampire. But I was betrayed by my squire, Renfield. He told me that the Lady Tatiana loved me. Yet it was a lie, which caused me to doubt myself. I was thus distracted when I faced the vampire. When I fell in battle, Lord Shane von Shane raised me as a mockery of what I once stood for. Now I serve the unending darkness. It is I who will put out your light.
I yield, though my spirit is trapped within these halls forevermore, betrayed by love and honor. Beyond here is the observatory. You will need to unlock its secrets if you wish to ascend to the higher halls of Castle Darkmoor. Until we meet again. There's a reason why all things are as they are. This is a room devoted to the lost art of perception, wizard. Can't you see what I see? Know that you cannot simply fight your way out of this one. <laughs> There are technical drawings here, with some notations on the page. It reads, The Grand Hartman Refractor can convert lunar rays to solar rays by focusing the beams through the focal point. The Hartman Refractor must be equipped with the Karman lens, and then positioned to capture the full lunar radiance. When assembled correctly, a beam of pure, unadulterated solar light should broadcast forth. You are not as blind and feeble as you first appeared. Come then, further into my lair, and steal yourself for the true country. 